An array of numbers is called a matrix. Here we have some data. We have data for four participants and their scores on three different tests. Test 1, test 2, and test 3. Below, we've rewritten this information to be displayed in a matrix. Here we still have the same information, the participant numbers and their test scores on tests 1, 2, and 3. It just looks a little bit different. Matrices are usually described by their dimensions. Matrices have rows and columns. So for our matrix, we have four rows and four columns, which makes it a four by four matrix. Each entry in a matrix is called an element. For example, 80 is one element in our four by four matrix. Here we have three different examples of more matrices. We have a 4x3 matrix, a 4x1 matrix, and a 3x3 matrix. This has just been an introduction to matrices. In future lectures, we'll be doing more complicated operations involving matrices.